Hey everyone, it's Alex, the real Mr. Robinson here, and I just finished watching the first episode of the new Muppet show, uh, simply called The Muppets. Uh, so this is pretty much a first impressions video. I don't have anything like really planned to say, or okay, you know what I do, but it's just I'm not very organized. But for this first impression, so I'm just gonna tell you what I thought of this first episode. Um, I thought it was good. I didn't think it was anything really spectacular or revolutionary in terms of TV, but it was enjoyable. The basic idea of this show is that Miss Piggy has a talk show called Up Late with Miss Piggy. Uh, basically, sort of like a talk show like Conan or The Late Show. And Kermit is the producer. The two of them have broken up, and the Muppets practically run the show. And it's pretty. it pretty much chronicles... The Muppets' life uh, as they do the show. And they do it in a 30 Rock office type vibe. Or Modern Family. Yeah, Modern Family office and 30 Rock type vibe. Where it's like there's a lot of uh, interviews with the individual characters on what they're thinking. Um, and it it's a different take for the Muppets. I mean, it's a format that... I feel like that this format is like what found footage is for movies. It's a very familiar format that could easily be really bad or work really well. And for the Muppets, I think it works because we've seen many interpretations of the Muppets. Um, like the original Muppet show from the 70s was like Saturday Night Live, huh? We've seen several movies that kind of have a similar vibe. So this one is a bit different. Um, it had some humor that kind of threw me off. That uh, It's like more adult humor, like Kermit Says Hell. Um, which, that, that kind of really threw me off, given that I've never heard any of the Muppets curse um, in my life. And then there's also something where Fozzie talks about how he tried online dating and what he... Uh, put in in the info section was a bear looking for love and if anyone who knows what uh, bear means outside of a bear it's a very hairy gay man so that threw me off a bit but at the same time I think what's important is does it have the spirit of the Muppets are the characters still the same and the answer is yes Kermit's still Kermit the Frog he's very uh, often cynical, worrisome, but he is still the leader of the band. Fozzie is still the jokester, a funny guy. Miss Piggy is still egotistic and full of herself and really funny. All the characters are still the same, so it, spiritually, I don't think anything's really changed. But again, the format of the show and the level of maturity that the jokes have, uh, for better or for worse, is different for the Muppets. So. I, again, I'd say this is good. It's not really aimed towards kids as much as uh, the last two movies were, The Muppets and Muppets Most Wanted. So it's more, I think it's more in line for people who grew up with The Muppets long ago, whether you're a hardcore fan, like from back in the 70s, or you're from that generation like me, where you're watching The Muppets as a kid, you kind of want to see a little... A mature version of them so I think it's good there is definitely some room for improvement and I feel like um, it could get better as time goes on because I've seen this with a lot of shows a lot of first episodes of a show aren't very strong I mean when you think back at the episode but as time goes on they have time to really perfect their craft so I feel like this show could easily do that um, um, again, it still does a good job at keeping the spirit of the Muppets alive, but this is a different format that I think with some tinkering could really work out. So I'm curious to see where the rest of the season goes. I think I'll keep watching it. And then once the season's over, I will come back and give my full thoughts on the season, how it fared out. And maybe I'll have a different opinion on this episode because I've had more time to think about it. But... Hey, that's my first impression of the Muppets. I still think it's good. Uh, but what did you think? Leave a comment to tell me what you thought of the first episode. If you've seen it, what did you think? Like, subscribe, share me with your friends. And this is the real Mr. Robinson telling you there is only one.